policy making process can be one where it's very fast paced and that means that there you don't always have time to scrutinize the evidence that you might use enough hello i'm magda osman and i'm head of research and analysis at the center for science and policy the university of cambridge and i'm a psychologist by trade and my main area of expertise is judgment decision making Evidence-based policy making, to me, is something that's fundamental because if you're going to make a decision, and particularly one which is going to be consequential, and where you end up being accountable to other people, um, it doesn't cut it if you just end up basing that decision on your own intuitions or opinion. So to be persuasive, about a decision that you take that's going to be consequential, then you'd want to be able to argue that position. And the best way to do that is to use evidence. The idea behind this course is that it will give you the tools that you need to answer these three very practical questions. First is, what does a good question look like and how do you ask it? The second is, what does a good decision look like and how can you make it? And the third is, what does good evidence look like and how can you effectively use it for your own needs? It might feel like uh, we're living in a world which is increasing in uncertainty and the policy issues that you might face uh, are getting more and more complex. And so the demands on evidence and using evidence to make sense of what to do are going to also increase. I think that the course would be uh, of value to anybody that works in a collaborative setting with other people making decisions that are going to affect uh, people beyond just their own organisation. So in any condition where you have to make consequential decisions on behalf of others, then this would be the course for you.